Hey kids, it's Sunshine. Today I have another Thread Up unboxing. I bought this box of shoes first time ever a few months ago, and I'm just now getting around to opening it. So let me show you what it looks like. So that's what it looks like. And we are going to unbox it together. So let's see what I got. I got 15 pairs of shoes. I paid a total of $84.48, which averages out to being $5.63 a pair. This thing is not going to focus right. Okay, let's get into it. It's kind of a small box too, which means there's probably no boots in it, unfortunately. Okay, so we're gonna open up the tissue paper. Oh, I see some. Oh, uh uh. Holy cow. And I let this box sit for six months. Oh, Lord. Okay. First pair of shoes. You know what? I should put my glasses on because I'm probably not going to be able to see these. Okay. I've never heard of this brand, Vasque. V A S Q U E. You guys ever heard of that but i like them because of the colors they're like a pinkish purple and they have vibram soles let's see they are a size nine and a half these are actually women's hmm. and i'd be surprised if these were ever worn i'm excited to look these up holy cow i can't believe i let them sit this long let me see if i can find the other one I mean, look at that. I wish these, they are new with tags. Oh, Gore-Tex. These must be hiking shoes. I wish they were in my size because I love the colors on these. So remember, each of these pairs I only paid $5.63 for. Oh, I love, love, love. Let's put them together. So cute. And you know I'm going to make more than $5.63 off of those. Exciting! I might have to get more of these. Then I found some Skechers, and I already have a pair of these. I think these are the Reggae Slims. And they're in really good condition, too. Let's see what size these are. Yeah, I should have put my glasses on. I think these are a size 7. So... They have your little toe ring right here. And then this is Velcro. And they have all that embroidery. Really good condition. And here's the other one. So cute. So cute. So happy so far. I may have to get these boxes instead of the men's boxes, of which I also have one that's been sitting for months. Okay. Let's see what else we got. I like that they rubber bands them together, the majority of them. I wish the um, brand was on the bottom so I could see it without my glasses. These are some, oh no. I hope these are bionic. <laughs> I can't see, darn it. I think these are bionic. I think that's what that says, look. You're probably not gonna be able to see it either. But I'm pretty sure that's what that says. No, it doesn't. Oh, darn. I was going to say, I didn't know Bionic made espadrilles. These are vents. Now, I've never picked up vents anything. So, I have no clue how well they're going to do. I'm not even sure that's real leather. And is there no size on these? Or am I just not looking in the right place? Unless it's, yeah, it's on the bottom, but I can't see it. So these are white, maybe real leather <laughs> espadrilles. They're in good condition, too. I'm surprised that white isn't all, you know, have marks on it and stuff. The soles have a little bit, you know, discoloration, but yeah, I've never sold vents before. So I have no clue how these are gonna do. That's funny, I thought, wishful thinking, I thought they were Vionic. No, they're vents. Hmm. Something I've never picked up, never wanting to, I have no clue. So I don't know. 
Two I don't knows. Oh, these will probably sell for around 30. The Skechers. Now these I have never found before. This is what I spotted when I first opened the box. Uh, they put UFOs in this box. Now I know this is a good brand. It's, I don't know how much it sells for because I've never found it. But these are UFOs in a size. Yeah, I like how I can't ever find the size. That's probably it right there. Okay, women's 10. Whoo, these will fit me. Might have to try these on. So yeah, they're in really good condition. In fact, I see no signs of wear. They may even be new. I got to get them under the light to make sure, but they may have never been worn. I mean, who donates stuff like this? I want to be your friend. So I've never sold them, never found them. I don't know, but I know they're going to sell for a lot of money. Okay, then we have some Western Chief. All righty. I have no clue who this brand is. And the size is something I'm not going to be able to see. Oh, a size 10. Do you know that all, all the shoes that are 10 will actually fit me? Now, these are cute. These are like coated something <laughs> in a nautical anchor print. Maybe they're a boat shoe. I don't know. They're a ballet flat. Really good condition. Never heard of this brand. I have no clue. But those are some cute shoes when you're out on the boat because they have that traction bottom, non-slip or whatever. So yeah, I'm anxious to look those up. I see some heels, which I don't ever pick up. You can see I'm dreading this. Okay, and they're nine west, which makes me dread them even more. These may be a donate because I am not messing with shoes that sit for years anymore. Okay, these are nine west. In fact, they may be new too. In a size nine, they're a T strap heel, black leather. I mean, they're cute, but I, I cannot sell heels. In fact, I can't sell wedges or espadrilles. So there's the nine West in a size nine. I might try listing those for 20. I mean, I'll look up comps, but. <coughs> oh, it went down the wrong hole. I don't know. Oh geez, here's some pointy ones. <laughs> here's some pointy toe boots. So these are suede. They don't have a side zipper. You're expected to pull those on. That wouldn't even fit my arm. <laughs> Look at this. Somebody has some skinny legs. That would not even fit my arm. And there's no brand on it. What is my hand feeling? I can't even get my hand in here. Now, how are people supposed to get their feet in here? Okay, so they're new. They're packed with paper. But I'm sure there's no brand or anything. Yeah, I don't see a brand. Oh, wait. I'm just not going to be able to read that. It's black on black. So there is a brand on these, but I can't tell what that is. If you guys know, let me know. And maybe the size is down there, too. And they are new, but yeah, I don't, I'll probably be donating these, too. I don't believe somebody can fit their, their leg in there. Here we go. Here we go. All righty. So I have no clue. And I see some more heels. Oh, they put the good ones on top. I see how that works. Okay. These are stained, suede, Steve Madden, who I also don't pick up or have ever sold. So these are Steve Madden. Zip back. Oh, yeah. And they have all this bling on them, all those jewels. Really fascinating. I mean, look at them sparkle. But yeah, I have no luck selling 
heels. And these are some, these are probably four inch heels. These are probably stilettos. And they have some staining, see right there? And all down the back, yeah. I don't know, what size are these? Yeah, there's a size on them, but I can't tell. I wonder if it's inside too. Oh yeah, it's this big, like I'm gonna be able to read that. But my guess is they're a good size, so they're probably like a 10 or 11. Here's the other one. Okay, so we have two over here that are probably going to be donated. I don't know. Like I said, i got to run comps and stuff, but I'm not messing with that stuff. I don't have room to store shoes for years. Yeah. Okay, another pair of pointies. And, yeah. Okay, these are... Uh, yeah, I don't even know what that is. Oh. Ann Taylor. I'm assuming these are black leather. They're embossed with croc. Croc embossed. Does it say the size on there, too? Um, it may say the size. I just can't read it. So, these are cute. I mean, cute, you know, as in work shoes or whatever. It's just not my forte. Stuff I don't like stuff I don't really pick up or list or sell. So there's some pointy toe and Taylor heels that I'll look up, but yeah, chances are they don't have any resale value. And then I found another pair of espadrilles. I better hurry up and get this stuff listed because we are like in that season. Okay, these are really rubber banded together. All right, what do we got? Um, coach. Hmm. Okay, so we have some brown leather. Yeah, I'll definitely be listing these. So we have some brown leather espadrilles. And they look to be in really good condition. I wonder where the size is on these. They could be anywhere. There is no size that I see. Oh, yeah, there is. Okay, it's really small. So, yeah, I'm not going to be able to see that. At least I found it. Looks like it says nine, but I don't know. Okay, so they're in really good condition. Perfect for the season we're in. Adjustable buckle ankle. So, probably around 35 or 40 for those. If Coach is still selling for the same. I haven't found Coach shoes in forever. Another pair of heels. Stuart Weitzman, another brand I never have picked up or sold. Or would pick up or sell. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so these are like beige or blush pink patent leather. Seven and a half. Backstrap heels. <laughs> These have some staining on them. So unless, look at that. Unless they're worth a whole lot of money. Yeah, those will be donated. Okay. Well, at least I, another pair of heels. This is like that one box of men's. They sent me all sweaters and I live in the desert. Same thing with the heels. You couldn't send me anything I don't like. Or that I, yeah, like the least. And especially Nine West. Okay, so these are Nine West. These also look like they've never been worn. And they are in a size, I can't read it. Looks like a nine. Pointy toe. Heels. If you guys want these shoes that I'm donating, I should have an email link down below. Let me know because if not, I'm going to donate them because I'm not messing with these. Okay, so then we have that. And then we have a pair of ballet flats. White House Black Market, probably leather, good condition. 
size are these? See, even though these aren't a high name brand, I'll probably sell these. I mean, keep them and sell them because they're easy to store. And I bet flats will sell faster than heels for me anyway. Okay, so I don't see a size on them, but I'm sure it's there somewhere. They're pretty small. My guess is they're a seven, but. So they have a, like a patent cap toe. And then the rest is like, um, that could be leather, really soft leather. So just your ballet flats in good condition. So we'll keep those. I know nothing about Nike Air sneakers, but at least they're Air. Although I don't see how. I don't see, does it look like Air to you? It says Air. Nike Air. Athlete, 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 I don't know. I don't know my sneakers, I should. And these may even be worth a lot of money, which I will definitely research these. And I can't see the size, but are these, no, these got to be men's. They look like a size eight and a half, but I don't know. And they feel like leather. Really good condition. Nike Air. Too bad they're not Jordans. Those I know bring good money. I don't know anything about them other than that. And it just says, yeah, Aflite. Interesting. Oh, let's see. Um, hmm. I don't know. I mean, it's got this cool tag in here, which you're not going to be able to see. A tag like I've never really seen before. So they may be worth something, I don't know, but I'm excited to see. I mean, I love Nike shoes, that's what I wear, but they just don't resell for me. Okay, we have one more pair. And these are figures. I knew I was gonna get something like this, only I expected more of them. Okay, so these are Croft and Barrel Ortholite flats. And they are in a size eight and a half. They're like tweed right here. And then that's probably leather, hopefully. <laughs> and they're in good condition. I mean, they need some cleaning out inside. But other than that, they're in not bad condition. Okay, let me see if I got 15 pairs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, yep. Okay, I got 15 pairs of which I'm probably, two, three, donating five, which would bring that cost of goods up to maybe eight to ten dollars, I'm not sure. But anyway, kids, that's what a shoe box looks like from Thread Up. well, one of them. I mean, I'm kind of happy. I just wish these hiking shoes were in my size. And which one do you think's worth the most money? Could be the UFOs. I don't know. You'll have to stay tuned to my Profit Picks video to see if any of this sells and what it sells for. So thanks for watching. Be sure to stay tuned for my next video. Have a great one.